you going to introduce us? Uh, <laughs> Brad. Girlfriends, girlfriends, Brad. Night, night. Uh, Brad Hamilton. Pleasure to meet you. Oh, how do you do? <laughs> so, Brad. Hi, I'm Khadijah. So, do you rent or own? I am renovating a townhouse. Where'd you go to school? The Cordon Bleu in France. Ah, you're a chef. Would you like some cheese? <laughs> no, thanks. So, so tell me, Brad, do you have a steady job? I own a supper club up in Harlem, oh. the Blue Bayou. Oh. Then I hear you've started your own magazine. Yeah, it's sort of an urban everything you need to know from a woman's point of view. <laughs> yes, well, we'd love to stay, but boring conversation isn't on our schedule. Ciao! Uh, bonsoir. <laughs> oh, well, she actually did all right for herself this time. Mm -hmm. Brother got it going on. I don't know. He's no Overton. <laughs> Word up. It's been a while since we've been out clubbing. And for free, shoot, I'm gonna make the most out of this. Remember how we used to give fake names to the guys who would try to talk to us? I was Alexis. <laughs> I was Dominique, right? <laughs> Ooh, tonight I'll be Shaquan. <laughs> yes. That suits me, yes. All right, all right, all right. I am ready to go. I got the slamming outfit on and my ponytail. <laughs> she was saying? With that, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> oh, we all look good tonight. Yes. She's a brick. Dun, 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 oh, she's mocked in my dad. Just letting it all hang out. Oh, she's a brick. Oh, 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 come on. How yeah. can she lose with what she used? 36. 24, 36, ow! Overton, we have a bathroom for that. You know, it's funny how every household has their own rules. I'm so sorry, Khadija, I swear. <laughs> I didn't see anything, nothing. Overton, get out! Is anybody all right? What happened? I just saw Khadija naked. I'm <laughs> devastated. <laughs> Thanks, Overton. Now, isn't this poetic justice? You vote to have him here, he sees you naked. Long live democracy. <laughs> <laughs> Khadija, you're not thinking about quitting. I ain't thinking about it. I'm committed to the idea. Khadijah, that is just stinking thinking. I want you to lift your chin and win. Yeah, I got to agree with my little Maya Angelou here. Come on, girl, you can't quit. Please, can and should. You need to put this petty sandbox feud behind you. For my favorite girl, on and off the court. Thank you, he doesn't deserve these. <laughs> She's quitting. Give me my flowers. <laughs> What's this about you backing in? Well, Scooch, she's afraid she's going to get whacked just because she's going up against the female Michael Jordan. <laughs> and I can't really argue with that. <laughs> oh, Khadija, come on. You're a young black woman with a college degree running your own business. You dismiss the odds every day. Now, this game is no different. You really think I can win? <laughs> what can we do for you, Kyle? <laughs> Actually, this is about what I cannot do for you. Um, when I joined this firm about three years ago, I believed it to be a place where a person advanced because of his or her ability. But I've, I've come to realize that this firm values the superficial over the substantial. But I cannot violate my personal integrity. My hair is not just for fashion. It's part of my heritage. It is a statement of pride. A statement 
by the way, which could show our clients that this firm is not only progressive when investing its money, but also progressive when investing in its people. So, gentlemen, whether you decide to promote me or not, <laughs> I will not change my hair. Okay. <laughs> That's it? Kyle, uh, we resolved the hair issue this morning. When Lawrence brought it up, we were concerned, but after some discussion, we came to the conclusion that you have just so eloquently stated. If we'd wanted to bring it up to you, Kyle, we would have. <laughs> Well, what I'm really concerned about is depression. Depression? Now, that's when you uh, sit around all day eating cookie dough and <laughs> crying at United Negro College Fund commercials. <laughs> no, that's not me. There's more than one kind of depression, Khadijah. Bipolar depression can be the opposite from what you'd expect. You're on a high, you can't sleep, you have mood swings, <laughs> and eventually, you crash. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> Look, the point is, I have my problems under control. Okay? I mean, what do I have to be depressed about? I'm not depressed. I'm happy. <laughs> I'm the happiest person I know. <laughs> you, you're not quitting on me. Uh, not just on you on the entire profession. In a few short hours, your industrious roommate has shown me how inadequate I am. Aww. Oh, but Reese, I was just trying to help a brother out. <laughs> and what a magnificent job you've done. <laughs> this doorknob, it shines as though it opens the gate to heaven. Get up off that now, don't touch it. <laughs> You are a domestic dynamo. I am not worthy to carry your feather duster. Now, I'm generally a pretty compassionate person. But this is just stupid. <laughs> Reese, this old house used to be this old mess. But your presence here made me understand that I could clean like I've never cleaned before. Isn't that what a good leader does? Lead by motivation? Like Benson and the governor? Oh. Hey. <laughs> I need you. The profession needs you. The world needs you. <laughs> Miss James, you've rekindled my lust to dust. Here. <laughs> go, man, go. Thank you. <laughs> and by the power vested in me, I pronounce you husband and wife. Go on and do your thing. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Mama, you in there? <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, welcome Mr. and Mrs. Overton Wakefield Jones. 